we have a plank on which we have kept a bar and this plank is doing SHM with amplitude A. We need to find the coefficient of friction between these two if the former starts sliding when the time period is less than t. So just imagine that if you are doing this SHM very slowly then the bar will not slip. But if you are doing it fast you can imagine that at the end the bar will slip. So less the time period more are the chances for bar to slip. So that's what he's saying find the coefficient of friction if the bar starts to slide when time period is less than t. So if time period is more then bar does not slide but at t is equal to one second bar starts to slide. So bar slips when period of plank is less than t we need to find what is mu. If bar has to slide it has to experience a maximum amount of frictional force which means its acceleration should also be maximum and that will happen on the extreme. So when it just starts to slide then it will happen at the extreme. So bar will experience maximum force at extreme SHM position and that time Fm, F max will be m into acceleration and acceleration at the extreme of SHM is omega square a. And as discussed at that moment the force the frictional force will reach its extreme that is mu mg. So this gives the equation mu mg is equal to m omega square a or mu is equal to omega square a by g. Now they have not given omega but they have given t. So we'll write omega in terms of t and this will be our answer. All right.